Hi everyone, my name's Steve from Ellistair and today I'm going to give you an overview of the Safety 2 tether station which is the most advanced of our systems. The Safety 2 allows you to add a new capability to your existing drone fleet by increasing the endurance of the aircraft. So the Safety 2's got a ruggedized design, IP54 certified, designed for use in the field in demanding environments such as border protection, event overwatch or tactical telecommunication applications. So it can be used in poor weather conditions uh, in temperatures between minus 20 to plus 50 degrees Celsius and also operational up to 4,000 meters altitude. So the safety can be mounted onto the back of a vehicle using the mounting points here and here. So we've got a 100 meter Kevlar reinforced tether which allows us to send continuous power to the drone and also communicate with the drone using the data transfer either over BPL or fiber optics. So the drone will pull the tether out of the tether station and then the tether station will wind back the tether uh, automatically using the winch guide you can see here to allow it to be wound nicely onto the drum. So we've got a range of air modules that allow us to connect to most drones on the market. Uh, some are dedicated such as the M300 or the M200 from DJI. Uh, others are more universal where we have 6S or 12S air modules that depending on the configuration allow us to supply up to 2200 watts to the drone. So we operate the safety using this control panel here. We've got a power on button torque control button with 10 settings, we can turn on or off the buzzer or the alarm and we can turn on or off the internal Wi-Fi. Uh, we've got a speaker here for the alarm and finally a reset button for maintenance. On the side we've got two RJ45 ports for the data transfer and finally we've got a power in socket which takes 120 and 230 volts AC. So the setup's really easy, uh, first we need to put a power source into the system either from the local network or from a generator. So we pull out a few meters of tether and then connect to the air module. Okay, so now turn on the drone and now power on the tether station. Okay, so the drone can now stay airborne for several hours without the need to change batteries as it's been powered through the tether. So the T-Monitor app allows us to safely monitor our flights and gives us information such as the flying time, the temperature of the tether station, how much power we're using, how much uh, cable speed we're pulling the tether out at, the length of the tether that's deployed, and how much torque we have applied. So thanks for watching. For more information, please visit our website at lstair.com.